Hello, everybody. Uh, this is uh, Tim Z Poet, uh, my new Facebook Viking clan, and this is my new series for the very, very low-level beginners. Uh, I already have uh, more advanced videos for more advanced players on MySpace. I am currently over eleven, uh, over level thirteen hundred and thirty something. Uh, but I have a lot of friends who are lower level, and I love the game, and I want to try to help uh, the beginners learn how to uh, get get to hang of the game and uh, do the best they can do. So, uh, people, uh, if you like this, send me a request. I need I need lots of Facebook uh, uh, Vikings. Uh, I just picked up one new chieftain. I now have ten chieftains. Okay, and this is part two uh, of the beginner uh, video series. Okay, I'm level five. I uh, now have maximum 25 out of 25 of energy. Uh, my stamina is 10 out of 10. I'm going to introduce you to boss battles. Okay, uh, what I forgot to point out, my health is 100 out of 100. I can't increase my health until I... Uh, I can't increase my health or my attack and defense until I reach level 10. And it appears that at level 5 is when you can start to do your boss battles. But even at the lower level, you can still do the world boss battle. But uh, this is some uh, something that I uh, was missing out on for a while. Go to home and you'll see this main menu thing here and we got the social feed here which uh, you toggle this here and it's view all friend messages quest help uh, request gifts general updates battle updates now this is something new I don't remember seeing this on the uh, MySpace uh, Viking Clan so I'm gonna have to check and see I'm not sure what Axe Slap help is it's probably something like battle help I guess uh, probably to alert uh, when you want to kill somebody that's hiding in a hospital or he's off at work or something or school. Uh, if a bunch of people uh, axe slap the guy, you can you you know if you get your whole clan after him, your whole guild after him, you you can kill the guy, you know. But one person by himself, he can only slap axe slap him once an hour. Okay, so if the guy uh, builds up his his defense pretty good, his health really good. Uh, one person's gonna it's gonna be really hard to to, to get touch them okay uh, this is share boost battle help elite chieftains this I highly recommend is be one of the first things you want to do uh, when you when you come to play uh, right now I've only got 10 in my uh, clan so there's not too much chance that I want to pick up an elite chieftain right now uh, this is boss battles so you can help your friends with their boss battles uh, lots of advantages to doing this, and uh, think there's you know I'll go into this a little more. This is a little more advanced, I'm, but I'm fixing to introduce you to the very first boss battle right now. Okay, challenge help. This is an excellent way of picking up the uh, last few points you need to level, and this is a uh, guild feed. Okay, but what I wanted to point out is the daily reward. Okay, I'm holding off on the daily reward because it's a bonus to my uh, stamina and my energy. Or my energy, okay. And uh, I can't cl if I click it. This is show daily reward. Well, it's kind of misleading because as soon as I click it, it does more than just show it. It uh, actually gives it to me. So I can't I can't look ahead and see which one it's going to give me. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and check my elite chieftains real fast and see if there's anybody that needs wants an elite chieftain. No, this girl apparently uh, she hasn't played in 16 days. So. Uh, she might not really, you know, uh, said apparently she's busy with other things or the game is uh, not real fascinating or she doesn't have it, she hasn't quite figured it out real good yet. Okay, we can click on this and see what level she is. Okay, she's uh, level 139, so apparently she's been playing a little bit. Okay, oh! She is playing, uh, apparently though, it says, this is interesting, it says offline, but then it says 58 minutes ago, 
So she must have been playing a little while ago. Because it says 58 minutes ago, uh, she joined clans with uh, this other person here. So now this is one way to pick up some new clan members. I can click on here. And it takes me to this person here, and guess what? They're uh, in my clan, so I don't know if that might be her lower level uh, um, deal, but this person is in my clan. Okay, so this here, if they have elite chieftains, it'll show down here. Okay, she has no elite chieftains. Let's go back to home again. Okay, and we go down here. Here's our top friends. This is when you want to add people. Send. This is one way to send them gifts. And uh, there I am. And she's 139. Let's check and see. Okay, yes. Yeah, see, she doesn't have any elite chieftains. Elite chieftains will give you can give you up to a total of five percent uh, battle boost. So when you're doing battle, before you do battle, you want to get your elite chieftain boost uh, and get all five elite chieftains. That'll give you the 5% uh, 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 chieftain bonus. Now, chieftains only stay uh, in your top chieftain for uh, uh, for like two days. Uh, here's the gift wish list. This is what uh, this is. I'm going to try to remember to show this to you. I probably should go ahead and do it now. Let's see. Uh, uh, all right. Uh, she hasn't filled out her gift wish list. This will help you with uh, getting the gifts you need for blacksmithing. I've already got a video on blacksmithing. It's an advanced video. Uh, I th think... Well, I will introduce you, I think, uh, to a little bit of it here. But let's go, since I'm sitting here right now with Energy 2525, I could be g earning more energy if I use up some of this energy. But right now, see, I, I spent seven minutes, and... Uh, it's hard to, time goes so fast, I can't believe this, especially when I'm filming a video, I can't believe how fast the time goes. Okay, I'm sitting at God, my God points are 19, when I get to 25, I can uh, buy a very powerful weapon, and when I go to home again, that's what these are, these are weapons that I can buy, and I can replace my lower value weapons, like the shield and stuff like that, with with this higher uh, 95 attack and 70 defense, okay, and it costs 25 favor points. I now have a 19, okay. Um, the gods go up one time each time you level up, uh, okay. Uh, this one here is 70 out of 95, so I prefer to have the highest attack that I can have, and uh, this is. Uh, a limited warrior and it's 81 attack and 60 defense. Now uh, let's do some adventures real fast because I I just need two two points to level up and get my five bonus points. Okay. Oh look, there's a bounty. But I don't want to. I don't want to. I'm sure I'm probably up. Oh, somebody's got them already. I, you know, uh, bounties go pretty quick. It's a way to earn a massive amount of money, but be careful if you attack somebody that's way above you, you open yourself to uh, being murdered, okay? Uh, you know, just think about it. You don't want to attack uh, a giant or Godzilla uh, with with just, a, you know, sticks and stones because you're going you're gonna to lose, okay? So, uh, I recommend uh, don't, don't go for somebody real high up. Okay, only go, go, uh, don't, tr I would recommend no more than double your level, probably, at the beginning until you get a feel for it. Okay, um, alright, let's go to adventures. Well, there's bounty again, let's see here, wow, see the bounty's gone that fast, man, that's, that is fast. I think somebody's probably got a bounty bot. Okay, bounty bot is a program that, uh, helps... It's a cheater, uh, a cheater method. Uh, it's a program that, as soon as somebody below a certain level has got a bounty on them, it it automatically attacks them. Okay, it's a program, and it's not it's not uh, it's not officially allowed. And if they catch you, they will ban you. Okay, so just be aware of that. I do not recommend using one. Uh, I think it's unfair. Okay, adventures. Okay, now 
you see when I go to here, this here is not grayed and this is challenge. All right, we're going to come back and do this, and I can attack. This is one thing I always want to do. I always want to attack the world boss uh, right up. Uh, attacks will use uh, on the bosses will use in battle will use stamina. They don't use your energy. Okay, so uh, but right now, yes, I, I I might as well because I'm at maximum a maximum health. Nobody's attacked me. Uh, I'm new to the game. They I'm apparently not on their radar yet. Okay. I'm going to attack. I love this picture. It's a nice picture, isn't it? Okay. And then you can attack with one stamina or five stamina. Uh, I highly recommend you get more points uh, that you attack with the with this here. Okay. It says victory. You have reached level six. Each time you reach a new level, the gods will reward you with favor points and skill points. You currently have five skill points. Use them to increase your skills. Now I can either click here and increase my skills, or I can go up to here where it says 5, and I can click on that. Now, um, right now, I'm getting ready to do some battle, but I want to go ahead and increase my energy a little more, and then I'll come back later and get this. Okay, now after you do this, you have to click Save, or you, you will... You, will notice that when you go back you'll still have a five or you might have 20 or 30 and you'll be wondering what's going on with this here it's because you haven't saved it okay I don't know why they make you do that but uh, I guess it's a case you want to change your mind or something I don't know okay I am 12 percent of the way towards my 250 energy where I'll get uh, three skill points okay and it will increase my energy uh, replenishment five seconds faster right now it's currently taking me uh, I think five minutes it can't it doesn't show right now because I'm at maximum energy as soon as I do an adventure okay let's go to here we've got all right here we, this is where if I want to do the boss battle okay uh, apparently I have four days to, to finish this battle okay and they give you rewards for uh, killing killing this you also get drop items. This is one way to pick up some weapons. Some of these uh, boss battles give you very nice, nice, powerful weapons. And uh, some have a uh, upkeep and some don't. And uh, right now, let's see, I have completed the harvest. I have completed the Consult the Oracle uh, adventure. I have completed the uh, Harvest Your Crop adventure. Okay, and I am now going to do, I'm going to start a pub fight. I've got both of the items I need. I need a, a helmet, and I need, like, I think it's a warrior. And uh, I'm going to click on do the adventure. Okay, 4%. I'm going to go on up this way here, up at the top, where I can kind of watch here. This gives me a, a visual indication here. But also I can see my level and see and then I can see the warning if somebody attacks me uh, I'm hoping that I don't get attacked for a little while and I get a chance to build up my deal but be warned if you attack somebody early in uh, starting a, uh, your adventure of uh, becoming a new clan member you'll be uh, attacked much more often because you're on their radar so let's do this again there's a bounty there but it's probably going to disappear quick Yep, it's gone. Okay. All right, now I'm 12%. 16%. I have 10 energy left. I'm about not quite halfway. I'm close to halfway now. Let's see, I got 5 energy. I'm going to go ahead and do one more energy here. Okay. Good work. You've used up all your energy on adventures and are on your way to becoming a powerful Viking. While well, you wait for your energy to refill, Go battle and build empire, or build empire. See the uh, gods for a quick refill. Well, if you go, you know, uh, I'm not going to use my. I got 20 god points now. I need five more. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and introduce you to this tab here. It's the boss battle. I could do the boss battle from from this tab, which shows all the boss battles available. Okay, and I can't do this mountain cyclops yet, but I can do the sea serpent, the sea sorceress, the serpent sorceress, I mean, level 1, North Midgard. It's also available 
in the adventure deal at the top of the uh, of the page. So let's we go ahead and attack her from here. Okay, you have successfully started a battle with the serpent sorceress, level one North Mid Midgard Coop boss. Okay, uh, your maximum health is low compared to the bosses. Increase maximum health to take and deal more damage per attack. You can arm yourself with additional items. Well, uh, let's see. Her her my attack is 16. My defense is 19. And she's 25 and 25. Her health is woo. Look at that, 30,000. Oh my word. Okay, this is going to wear me down pretty bad, uh, probably. Let's let's attack again. Let's see. Okay, I took, I did nine, nine I gained nine experience points. I got 500 gamer points. I got 19,688 coins. I lost two health, and I lost five stamina because I'm using the five, uh, five stamina attack. Uh... I did 323 health uh, damage to her. Okay, but see, she's got incredibly strong health. And I picked up a Serpent Claw Blade, okay? Now, uh, later I'll show you how to find out what the uh, what the strengths of those that weapon is. Uh, that was prob That's probably much better than anything I've got right now because I've got this uh, wooden shield in the Thor's amulet. And this is great because I don't have this yet. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and attack her. My stamina is five out of ten, so I'm gonna I can attack her one more time. Okay, now my stamina is down to zero. Okay, did about the same. Everything here is the same. Okay, you can see my levels gone up some. Okay, with because of the experience points, I got uh, six experience. Okay, and another fifteen thousand something dollars in coins. Oh, there we go. I can. I uh, was. What was I needing? A hundred and fifty thousand to buy the property I wanted. I now have a hundred and sixty-two nine thousand five hundred and fifty-one. So to buy property, I go to Empire. Okay, it's just letting me know here that uh, that I need a good hourly income. Okay, so I now have I have ten I already have ten of these uh, dwellings. Okay, and they cost uh, initially they they make me one hundred uh, gold coins per dwelling. I bought ten, so that's why I have a a, a profit up here of a thousand. And when I go down here. All right. If you look at the math, uh, if I buy one of these for ten thousand, I'm getting a return of one hundred. Okay. Uh, so that's about. I think uh, I'll, I'll work the math out and try to give you guys a better deal. And I'll, I'm going to do a blog on this. All right. But if you look for fifteen thousand, okay, just fifty percent more, I get three times as much income. All right, so that that without even working all the math out, this this I'm I'm spending 50% more, but I get three uh, 300% better, three times better. Okay, so I'm gonna go over here. Uh, if I buy one at a time, the value keeps jumping, and I'll pay uh, I will end up paying a lot more than 150,000 um, for 10. So I want to buy 10 at a time. Okay, if I buy one each time, I get to 15,000. It's not. It's. It's. It, I. I can't. It's going to cost me a lot more because it, this first time I buy it, it jumps up. Okay, so if I buy one, it's going to jump up in price. Right now, the most I can buy is ten. So I want to buy ten, and that may, allows me to get ten at the price of uh, fifteen thousand a piece. That will increase my income three thousand. Okay, ten times three hundred, and I'll now be making four thousand an hour. Okay, I want to build them. Click build. It says victory. You built ten longhouses for 150,000 coins. Build ten more. Well, I can't do it because I don't have the I don't have enough cash. I'm down to 12,951. Okay. Uh, this year, little red deal is indicator of my uh, that I still have gamer points uh, uh, things to uh, to accomplish. Okay. I'm not going to do battle, so I know it's going to be there. But okay, it shows that I have. 
I'm 40% complete on my boss battles. Okay, so, uh, and I have, uh, looks like 4 hours and 33 minutes to finish this, okay, in the day. Okay, because, yeah, it's 9, 9, almost 9.30. Okay, I guess apparently at midnight or 1 o'clock, yeah, 1 o'clock it looks like they uh, switch over. Okay, that's cool. I didn't realize that before. All right. My health was 96, uh, I, I damaged myself in battle when I was fighting the boss. Um, I only have an energy of 1 out of 30. Okay, if I had more clan members, I could pick up some, uh, some experience points by helping uh, my other clan do uh, quest and uh, other, other things. Now, there is one thing I can still do. Okay, it's the uh, it's the challenge deal, the hunter challenge. Okay, uh, two arrows are available, and I've already done some of this here, so we're going to play the game. Um, all right, and this here, some people might think it's just terrible because they've got little bunny rabbits and stuff like that, but they've also got these wild boars. Okay. A lot of people that might feel sorry for a wild rabbit, they, they're, they're going to say, shoot that, shoot that wild boar. Yeah, they don't, you know, because then things are dangerous, okay? Wild bears, okay? Yeah, they may be cute, but deer, well, hey, you got to eat, man, you know? They don't got grocery stores back in them days. Didn't have grocery stores back in them days. Okay, get free shots. Well, I don't know. I, I don't have very many friends, so I don't know if anybody will help me, but I might as well uh, request and see. Okay, I did pick up a few experience points, I think. Yes, I need six more to level up, and then I'll get my five, and then I can increase my energy some more. So, let's see here. Let's try going to home. Let's just check and see. Okay. Uh, like I said. Okay, one of the first things I want to check is uh, quest help. Okay, 73 days ago. Oh my word, it's been quite a while. She's apparently she's not taking advantage of requesting help with her quest. Okay, you you get you. Get, I'll show you how to do this uh, uh, a little later. You you pick up uh, more points uh, by having your client help you, uh, but you have to make it the help available to them. Okay, let's check the challenge. This is the other thing you want to check is the challenge help. Okay, she wanted to help with her rune challenge a while back, but that was 11 days ago, and it's not, it's not, see, it's going to say this player has reached the maximum of 12 friends helping. Okay, um, so there's several ways now to try to add friends. Okay, first thing you do is you go to home, and, uh, what's, what's tricky about adding friends is, uh, first you got to get them into your MySpace friends. Okay. And then you have to get them into your clan. So you often run into the situation where somebody sees themselves as your friend, and they're on your friend list, but they're not. Uh, they're still showing up on the battle board. Okay, these people are already in my clan. If they weren't in my, if they were, fr if they were a friend and not in my clan, there's going to be a little green plus sign right here, and uh, you click it, and it will. Uh, I haven't fully worked out how it works, but it sends them, a, uh, I think, an invite. And then when they accept it, then they become, uh, they're in your clan. So uh, people need to learn to, uh, first they got to go to their profile and check to make sure that they are uh, letting people, uh, accepting their friend request. Because, uh, and then you got to go through this list here. And uh, I don't have very many. I, here's the up and down arrow. Let's go down and see. Okay, this, this level, these people are level one. They might have added the app and they don't know what to do. Uh, okay, so hopefully this video will help them out. Um, send Berserker Boost. Okay, this is a nice thing to do to help your friends out. I'm going to send energy boost to the inner circle. Okay, and this is, I haven't shown you the inner circle yet. Okay, you currently have no inner circle members to send family boost to. They've already got their boost, apparently. 
Share Berserker Boost with Chieftains. Okay, let's go ahead and do that. You have successfully sent an offer of Berserker Boost to your Chieftains. You are a good Viking. Check back uh, regularly to send out more. Okay, when you want to do battle, okay, as I said, you want to, uh, before you start your battle, you want to get maximize your strength as much as you can, and you do that by going to home. You do First, you try to add your elite chieftains, okay, and when you get more clan members, you have more. Uh, you need five elite chieftains to get your 5% boost. Then you can go here, and we might as well go ahead, and I want to go ahead and show you how it works. Okay, uh, this is where I'm requesting a, a, a boost, but I can, uh, let's see if it's, if I can still collect this boost from her. I don't know if I can or not. No, nope, this boost is no longer available. We'll be quicker uh, next time, okay? So right now I need some more friends. Uh, that's, I don't have any, uh, any uh, boost available to use, so this is also, like I said, I'm holding off on this. Uh, because this is my daily reward and it will uh, give me a uh, a bonus uh, percentage increase to my either my energy or my stamina okay I've got two energy I need six more to do it when I do this one adventure it's a it takes five it takes five energy to do the adventure but it okay and it gives me five five uh, reward okay um, and 1400 uh, cash my next adventures will be hunt for wild boar and it requires seven energy and I'll have to have two of these uh, sword warriors here alright I've already got them so I'm good to go on this here uh, then then the next next one after this is raid a farm Okay, these are all still really low, low uh, adventures. Uh, once you get higher level, you won't do these very often uh, because there's uh, much better, better uh, adventures to do, and the higher adventures give you drop, uh, drop uh, rewards. Okay, you get you get uh, either weapons or warriors for completing the uh, the adventure. Okay, right now with everything is take here we go here's our first one uh, and this is called collect protection money it will be available when I reach level seven and this is where I can get my uh, chainmail armor okay so every time I do well not every time but it's a random type deal okay so I uh, I'll soon be able to do this here. Okay, because I am now level six and I'm coming up on level seven. Okay, uh, I've got three. I need six. Okay, let's see. All right, the first one. Yeah, it takes one energy and I get one experience. Three energy and three experience. Five and five. Okay, seven and seven. Some of the higher levels, you get more energy. You get more experience points than the energy you use. Okay, like here we go. There we go. Now. It, this one takes uh, the locked one uh, takes uh, 11 energy, but it pays out 12 experience. Okay, so this is shows that this is a better deal uh, for gaining uh, experience points. Okay, some of these reward a little more cash than uh, so, so you might want to look around if you're needing more cash or more experience. Um, you can you can pick a, a battle an adventure that will will help you get what you're needing. Okay, uh, uh, at level ten, um, storm a watchtower becomes available, and it will require thirteen energy and it pays out fifteen experience and forty thousand cash. But I will need these items here. Okay, and uh, the reason uh, different browsers work different. I have a uh, Fire, I mean, I have Chrome 11 Beta, and I've got an, uh, what's called an extension uh, deal here, which expands pictures, and it overrides the uh, typical text deal that will tell me the name of the item. So, um, I'm got to look into see if there's a way to temporarily shut this off when I'm playing Viking Clan, because it would be very useful to me. Sometimes it's hard to remember because there's lots and you get high up there's lots and lots of uh, different items and 
It's hard to remember the names of all these things here. Okay, when I get to level 10, also I will be able to uh, burn an enemy ship if I ha it'll take if I have the right uh, right weapons and the right warriors. Okay, um, and it will it uses 11 energy and it pays out uh, 12 experience and 30,000 reward. Okay. Uh, this here shows that there's only three hours and forty minutes left in this uh, boss battle. Uh, till I can, no, this is three. I can attack again in three hours and forty minutes. Okay, uh, this is something when you're very when you're beginning, you want to stay on top of this and you want to uh, get as many in as you can because this has got very good rewards. This pays out uh, nice nice battle drops. Okay. Uh, but you got to attack enough, and uh, after you attack like five times, ten times, and fifteen times, you get uh, uh, like I said. Uh, after so many, uh, you know, attacks, you get you get rewards. Okay, let's see. Oh, my stamina has increased pretty quickly. Uh, okay, it's increasing faster than I realized. So what I, I can, uh, I don't have my five uh, energy that I want to do the the. Uh, next adventure so I'm gonna go ahead and do this boss battle let's just check and see if we can see the bounty it's gone again wow I'm amazed how fast this is uh, the bounty is going it's I'm very suspicious that either somebody was waiting you know they knew that somebody was gonna put the bounty out and so they're wait, ready right there to get them or somebody's using a bounty bot okay um, let's see here okay. I want to do boss battle okay there we go this shows the boss battles available, and right now it's uh, like I said, I still have three hours and 38 minutes before I can attack the world boss again. But I'm going to go ahead and attack the uh, the uh, serpent sorceress. Okay, and uh, I am really close now to leveling up. Okay, my health is back up uh, 100%. Okay, I'm going to attack with with the five stamina. There we go. I have now reached level seven. I've got five uh, uh, skill points available. Okay, and might as well let's hurry up and go ahead and do this. I'm gonna go ahead. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and add five more to my energy. Okay, I'm 14% of the way towards getting my 250. Um. Let's see, okay. When I level up, it increased my stamina, it filled my stamina back up, and it filled my energy back up. Okay, so now I've got, uh, I can, I can do adventures. Okay, I'll do a few more of these, uh, since I'm 24% of the way done. Okay, I'm going to roll up here so I can kind of, uh, see what's going on with my level. Okay. See as I click that, my my I'm jumping up. Okay, I've got I still got my stamina. Okay, I'm using up my energy. See there, there we go. I used up uh, five five energy because I'm using the five stamp. Uh, no, I'm I'm doing that's right. I'm doing adventures right now, and it's using uh, energy. All right, uh, I'm 44 percent of the way done. Um, about halfway from level seven to eight now. Okay, I have five energy left, so let's attack one more time. And I've used up my energy. Now it's time to switch over to uh, see. Right now, this is to point out that I'm, I'm vulnerable to being attacked. Okay, uh, I'll go into this in more detail right now, though. Uh, like I said, I'm still, uh, luckily I still haven't come on to the, uh, anybody higher up's radar yet. Okay, I'm going to do a few more of these boss battles. Okay, I got quite a long time before I kill this, this boss because I'm so weak. Okay, but, I'm uh, maximizing my, uh, my, my collecting, collecting experience points. Okay, I've still got five, so I can attack uh, one more time. It's dropped me down to 96. When I get down to a certain point, I'm not vulnerable to attack anymore. It's an interesting, uh, strange concept to this game that 
once you get too weak, you're, you're, you, you gain pro hospital protection. So, that's, uh, this is the first game I've come across that concept, uh, basically, uh, let's see. Okay, I'm now sitting at zero energy and zero stamina. I have 90,000 coins. Let's look at here at uh, Empire and see what I need for my next next purchases. Okay, uh, since I now have 10 dwellings, I have 10 longhouses. The next item I can buy is farm and it get, pays out 700. Okay, let's look and see what the cost is. Uh, so that's a little over twice what uh, the income of a longhouse okay so let's see if I wanted to buy ten, uh, a longhouse it's going to cost me 30,000 if I want to buy a farm it's going to cost me 48,000 okay that I can quickly calculate in my head uh, that this is about like I said this is about 50% more uh, the cost is about 50% more but I'm getting uh, a hundred percent more uh, income out of it. So what I want to do is I want to I need four hundred eighty thousand to buy ten of these. Okay. Then the next item I'll be able to buy is a blacksmith shop, and it pays out five thousand, and it's going to cost me two hundred twenty thousand for each one. So I'm going to really need two million two hundred thousand before I want to buy any of these. Okay, I'm level seven. Um, let's check my my uh, my clan and check my warrior. All right, see if you see right here, warriors is lit up. Okay, and that's where I buy my warriors on this tab. When I want to buy weapons, I click over here. When I want to see what special items I have and how many, uh, I click here. And when I want a blacksmith. I click here okay so we'll check this in just a minute uh, right now I've got uh, 10 scouts okay I've got uh, 10 warriors 10 axe warriors and I've got 20 sword warriors okay I now have uh, okay and then uh, I'll be able to buy archers when I reach level 10 okay archers uh, have an attack of four and a defense of four, but they have a hundred and fifty dollar per archer upkeep. So that means if I buy ten archers, it's going to cost me fifteen hundred an hour upkeep. So you want to pay attention to this because if you buy a bunch of these things that got a lot, a lot of upkeep, and you don't have the income coming in, you're in negative income, and your your archers will disappear. Okay, because you don't have the upkeep, they they die, they starve. Okay, so don't don't buy too many until you've got the money to to keep them alive. All right, so I have uh, oh I've picked up a new chieftain. That's really cool. It always uh, to me it's kind of exciting uh, every time when especially when you're just starting out and you've got a new chieftain. Whoa, because it makes you it makes your uh, clan stronger, man. Okay, uh, I've got 11 chieftains. Okay, so that means I can have 110, 110 uh, warriors in battle. I've got, let's see, we got 10, 20, 30, 50. I only got 50. Okay, uh, let's see, I got 90,000 available. Okay, let's buy 10 more. Let's buy 10 more of these because I want to get my strength up. Right now I need strength a little more than I need income. Okay, I'm going to buy 10. Okay, it says victory. You bought 10 sword warriors for 6,000 coins. Uh, that's pretty cheap still, but like I said, and I now own 30. Okay, so that's, let's see, 30, 40, 50, 60. I still really need some more weapons, but uh, okay. There we go. I've still got 88,000. So, uh, okay, I can buy 10 more. Okay, yeah, okay. And let's see, now I, let's buy another 10. Okay, now I've got 76,000 left. I've got 50. 
let's see, 60, 70, 80, okay, let's see, I think 90, 100. Okay, I need 110, let's buy 10 more. Okay, I now have 80 uh, sword warriors. Okay, I have, uh, and like I said, once I jump here, things change, okay, because these are going to cost me upkeep. So right now, I want, you know, ideally, uh, I would be the as strong as I could be right at this point if I had 110 of these here. Well, I've got 80, 90, 100, 110. So I have, I have my, uh, my 110 warriors now. Now let's go check my weapons. Okay, I, I'm allowed uh, 10 warriors per chieftain. And I'm allowed uh, five weapons per uh, warrior, so that I'm I'm allowed uh, half as many um, weapons. So I've I can have 110 110 uh, chieftains, but I can only have I can only take 55. I can have as many as I buy, but I can only take 55 into battle. Okay, uh, and again, you want to buy the strongest ones. Okay. Uh, I have uh, ten helmets, one knife. Okay, and this is uh, okay. This is one thing. The weapons they stay the uh, they stay the same price. It's not like property. So I can buy uh, another one. Okay, I got two now, but I can go up here. And they've now added a really nice feature. I can stay here when Chrome allows me to sit here. And I can uh, do this. Other browsers, they keep jumping all the way back up to the top, and you got to roll back down. That's the main thing I like about Chrome is that uh, they've fixed it now. So with Chrome, it works. Okay, I want I want to go ahead and get ten. Oops, ah, I went past eleven. I meant to get ten. Okay, all right. Um, let's see what my cash. I got fifty-six thousand. Okay, I want to go ahead and get ten of these light axes. Let's let's see. Okay, I should, okay, that was that wasn't much. It was only thirty five hundred. Okay, um, I want to get at least ten of these. Okay, and remember now, I'm looking for fifty five fifty five uh, weapons. I've got ten uh, fairings. 10 light axes, that's 20, 31, 41, let's see what we got for income, 46,000, okay, let's get, get 10 more, uh, 10 more of these, okay, 20, 30, 41, 52, 53, 54, 55. Okay, uh, I'm not going to buy any more because I'll be wasting my money right now because they're not doing me any good. Uh, these here, like I said, the only th good they're doing me right now is they're providing me with defense. Okay, um, my stamina is going up. I can uh, in another minute I can do a five. Uh, a five stamina attack on the on the boss. Um, okay, let's go ahead, and I'm going to show you uh, what I can do with with blacksmithing. Okay, I'm very low level, but bla you have to, in order to get to the blacksmithing uh, uh, button here, you have to click clan, and then it opens up this uh, this, this level here, this uh, navigation level. Uh, so you can buy warriors, weapons, special items, and you can do blacksmithing. Okay, uh, so now we're going to go down here. This is uh, this is the workbench, and you drag the items here, or you can use the autofill. Okay, this is your uh, weapon collection. Okay, and it can display. This is a toggle switch that displays all of them, weapons or warriors. Okay, uh, right now, uh, see some items. There's some items are hidden. They do that to make the game a little more challenging, but they don't want to make it so it's, I mean, when you get higher up, trying to figure some of the higher ones are, are extremely, 
some people have given up on it and decided it's not even cost effective but uh, if people if you if your clan works on it together uh, it can be systematically figured out and I know most of these uh, up to almost the 2000 level I know almost all the hidden ones and I will reveal the secrets to my clan members okay and these videos will not be available to the general public they will only be available to people who are in my clan okay uh, why sh I mean I'm giving the information out to help some you know everybody get them interested in the game but I don't want to give away all the good secrets because then uh, you know you gotta you know uh, that's the reason for top secret clearance man you can't give out all the information to your nuclear subs and how to make a nuclear missile and, and expect to uh, to stay top dog okay Highland Rangers okay this is recipe detail and a Highland Ranger has a, a five attack and five defense now the biggest reason I've, I I in my mind for for blacksmithing these items is once you when you blacksmith these items all right some of the higher ones they cost a lot of money but they have no upkeep okay so that's where they they become very valuable to me okay because see this allows me to have uh, uh, these Highland Rangers have a five attack and five defense and uh, I have ten and ten ten of what I need ten of these and I need ten of these and ten of these to uh, make it when I craft it it'll it'll let me know so uh, all right they're a thousand dollars a piece and I do have thirty eight thousand so I can make ten so I'm gonna go ahead and craft ten boom there we go success okay I have successfully crafted the following items I have crafted ten Highland Rangers okay and uh, it took ten scouts and ten warriors and ten thousand coins to craft these okay now uh, when I first was started doing this I thought I had to go up here and click click the close box well in Chrome at least you don't have to you can click uh, outside the box and it makes it disappear okay now uh, this here you notice it says missing okay I, I don't have enough okay I'm, I don't have any all right um, I can go here and buy some more okay this click in here will take me to to the deal so I can buy uh, let's see what we got okay I got 80 sword warriors okay see it doesn't list them on this this deal here because they're now they're listed in the special items okay when I do this, it reveals that my Serpent Claw Blade has an attack of 15 and a defense of 7. Okay, and I have 3. Ooh, okay. Now, my Highland Ranger, I have 20. Okay, now, uh, you got to be careful. Uh, this is a little tricky because uh, Highland Ranger is not a weapon, he's a warrior. Okay, so I want to have 110 warriors of the strongest warriors I can, and the Highland Ranger is the he's the highest right now a warrior that I can have. Uh, all right, um, right now I'm using a wooden shield, uh, seven and eleven. Okay, look, fifteen and seven. Okay, well this has got a good defense, but this has got a really a lot better attack. Okay, and the Thor amulet. Oh look. It's only eight and seven, okay. Uh, Fifteen and seven. Hey, okay. There we go. We're gonna go here to the profile. Okay, and this is called uh, when you go down here. All right, this is. I already showed this in the first part of the video. Uh, basic uh, uh, where it gives you your stats. Okay, I'm level seven. Okay, my health is 100 out of 100. My energy is three out of 35. My stamina is 7 out of 10, my total attack is 16, my total defense is 19, I have 28,000 in gold, my income is 4,000 coins per hour, my bounty has increased, see, from 25,000 to 40,000 because I bought more property, I have 11 chieftains, I have 110 uh, in my clan, I have 60 weapons, okay, uh, 55 is uh, all that I can take into battle. 
All right. Now this is called customizing your loadout. Okay. I can I can change these here and put the stronger. I want to use the strongest um, weapons and stuff that I've got available. Okay. This takes you to this little deal here. It's called your personal loadout, and this is how you change and equip yourself for extra power in battle. Okay. When I got this uh, highlighted here. This is one of my items there, and what I want to change, it shows that the Serpent Claw Blade is, would give me a 8, eight plus increase on my attack, but 4 decrease on my, uh, on my defense. Okay, now, uh, <coughs> I'm going to click, because this has got the higher defense, I'm going to click this, and now it switches, okay, and it says that the Serpent Claw Blade is, uh, has got a seven uh, points better attack and seven uh, the same same exact uh, no increase on the uh, deal. But I have increased my by clicking this here and arm myself. I'm going to arm myself. Okay, now it's replaced the Thor amulet with the um, the serpent claw blade, and I have increased my uh, my attack and def my attack, my defense stayed the same, but I increased my uh, my attack by about eight points. Okay, uh, this is still locked right now. Uh, okay, I'm don't know uh, what the full deal on, on this is. It might be that I have to get a little higher, or I might not just might not have the item. Okay, let's see what happens when I click it. Okay, it's just because I don't have anything there, so I, okay, I can take uh, and I can now use. Okay, I've already using the uh, the wooden shield. Okay, these are the only weapons I've got right now. So let's go ahead. We're going to take the Thor amulet now, and we're going to use that. Okay, I still fully not. Okay, I still got to figure this out a little bit. Exactly the explanation of how it all works. They you originally only had two two items, and then they added this third one, and uh, so now I've re-added the Thor amulet back. Okay, so I could have just went uh, down to the empty spot and clicked it, but I thought it was grayed out and locked. I saw that lock. Okay. Um, Here's a bounty. Let's look in here and stuff. No bounty. It's already gone. Okay. Stamina. Whoa! This stamina is, is I guess it's every every two minutes. So, okay. Let's go to the boss. We're going to attack him. And then it gives me... I didn't attack him yet. It got me to the point where I can choose to attack with a one stamina. Or I can use the slider and use two, three, four, and up to a maximum of four. But I can click here and I can attack with a five. Okay. And I only have four stamina left. I can either wait another minute and nine seconds and hit him with a five. Or I can go ahead and uh, attack with, with uh, upwards of four. Okay. Um, four more minutes. I'll have uh, my extra energy and I can I can do the five, five energy attack. I need to tie up this in this video up pretty quick because I am uh, at 54 minutes, coming up on 54 minutes, and if you're still watching, then uh, I appreciate it, and I uh, hope you appreciate, uh, and leave me uh, my efforts, and give me uh, some suggestions and comments on what you think of these videos. Okay, um, let's see here. We got 20, 20 seconds, 18, 17 seconds, okay. All right, I'm up to, let's see. Okay, five, I can do this, I did it there. We're, oh, we're at two points, two points from leveling up. Okay, so, uh, this is a case where I think I'll just go ahead and do a, a one of these. Oh, and see, I, I 
that's right. I sold I sold these items, so I need one of these scouts. Let's just buy one for right now. Okay, and I'll go ahead while I'm down here and buy one of these because I know I need that for doing the other adventure. Okay, let's see. Back to adventure. Okay, I need two, so I might as well buy a second one. Okay, adventures. Alright, I would uh, hold up, but I want to hurry up and level up. So I'm going to go ahead and do this here. That now allowed me to uh, level up. Okay, and I'm now level 8. And I've got a 5... Uh, five um, skill points uh, it's filled my stamina back up with 10 and my energy has been filled up I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to increase my energy to 40 and I'm going to click save okay I'm now 16 percent of the way I still got quite a ways to go alright let's go to adventures real fast and this time I want to do the uh, finish up with these five point adventures see that's where uh, you know because I was so close to leveling it was more advantage uh, and that and that advantageous to me to uh, to do a lower uh, deal just to level up okay Let's see we're 80 percent complete this is all right I've used up my energy Okay, there's also a thing, if I click, watch this, if I click it one more time. Nope, okay, I, I, when I get higher, I guess I have to be a little higher up before I can get the energy boost. Okay, uh, later in the game, you're allowed energy boost. And, uh, it's not available yet right now. Okay, I, now I'm out of, uh, I'm out of, uh, energy, but I can, I have 10 stamina. So I can go back to the battle, uh, to the boss battle, and I can start uh, start battling again. I can I can attack them at least twice. Okay. Uh, okay, the bounty uh, is gone. Okay, I got now I have a hundred and forty one thousand, and I think I was needing what three hundred and fifty thousand. Uh, we need to go to Empire to buy property. Okay, yes, no, I need four, 480,000 to buy my 10 farms. Okay, um, this looks like a good place to end the video uh, right now. Uh, okay, let's check my, okay, oh, chieftains, wait a minute. Uh, when I go here to here, I can see, try to, I can find out who my uh, new, uh, New chieftain is and I don't really see hmm well I'm not really sure on this so um All right, this uh, ties up part two, I guess. Uh, I hope you guys uh, find this useful, and uh, have a good day.